shout out to Antonio Smith for sending me this story that is also coming out of Florida, where you have this thumb face looking heifer by the name of Anastasia Tash or Tosh, who decided that she was going to use her hand as a nutcracker. Take that how you want to before I even say what I'm getting ready to say. So this woman was arrested for grabbing her husband's penis too forcefully. The article reads, she's a real ball breaker. A sex hungry Florida woman was busted for allegedly grabbing her husband's genitals with such force that the victim crumpled over and had trouble walking. Anastasia Tosh, age 44, was charged with domestic battery for the Monday incident that occurred at the couple's Tampa home. According to the complaint, Tosh clamped down on her husband's manhood while he was sleeping on the couch at around 5 a.m. So she basically did this at a point where he could not really defend himself because she knew had she tried to do that, do that while he was awake, he probably would have knocked her ass out. Without provocation or permission, Tosh walked over to the victim and grabbed his genitals. The police were called and Tosh admitted to grabbing the victim's genitals without his consent. Tosh claimed that she grabbed her husband in a sexual manner because she was attempting to arouse the victim in an effort to have sexual intercourse. Police said that Tosh and her husband have to feel any type of sexual arousal if his woman walks over to him while he's sleeping and grabs a handful of his nuts and starts to squeeze on them as if she is about to crush, like I said in the beginning, crush nuts. As if she's squeezing one of those little, sque- one of them stress, like them little stress balls. Like, what pleasure does a man get from that? That's excruciating pain. If you even slightly tap, and I'm speaking of this as a guy, if you even sla- slightly accidentally tap a guy down there, it's sensitive. So imagine someone squeezing your damn testicles. That could actually, all jokes aside, that could actually do some serious damage. You saw where it said he had trouble, it said he had trouble walking. That's not being over dramatic. Like if you if a guy gets hit there, what it does is it sends like a shock, like a jolt of lightning through your body to the point where you are completely disoriented until that feeling goes away. And depending on how hard it is, it could take a while. Because trust me, I remember when I was in middle school and this didn't happen to me. I remember when I was in uh, middle school and uh, one of the people in the gym class had got accidentally hit there by one of the girls. And he literally had to sit down on all fours and tears started to come out of his out of his eyes. And literally, he sat there literally almost the entire gym class period. So, yes, it does do something to you or to us if we get hit down there. Why do you think whenever why do you think whenever if you like watch a movie or something like that, one of the first things a woman does to get away from her assailant is to kick the man in the balls and he immediately falls back. It's a, it's a very sensitive area, but yeah, this woman definitely should get severely charged for what she did. Cause I don't know how in the hell she felt like she could think that was going to arouse her man. Like I don't get it. And when he was sleeping, like, nah i think there's way more to it i think she she, and like she's just operating like a beast she's basically looking at this picture she's basically the palm colored version of rasputia from norbit her husband is norbit and she's rasputia but y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comments like share subscribe i will talk to you in the next one